Hello, I am the Atheist Gamer, and today the video that I am responding to pretty much just fucking pisses me the fuck off. Before I start this video, I had to get really, really, well, let's just say drunk with soda. Because the video is basically so fucking stupid that I feel like I shouldn't even show my face at this point. At least for the beginning. That being said, let's just take a look at the entire video and then let me just give my two cents on it. You know, this really pisses me the fuck off that someone would create such a stupid fucking video who would consider being called beautiful as a form of street harassment. I do not see this person as a human being. At least, I, if I see her, I wouldn't acknowledge her as beautiful because her personality is ugly just from, from this from this particular video. If I had to call her out anything, I call her a big, massive bitch. And I would record it with my camera too, to tell her that she's a big, massive bitch. Her personality, I don't know her. I, I don't know her personality that well, but the fact that she made a video like this pretty much deserves the title, bitch. One big fucking bitch. <sighs> Let's just take a look at the video again. Okay, first of all, there were a bunch of guys, you know, they just acknowledge her, they call her, hey, how are you doing? They just, you know, complimented her. They said, hi, hello. And that's, it's, and somehow, somehow that's street harassment. And set that aside. Some of the guys say, hey, beautiful, you know, or say they're, they're beautiful or cute or whatever. That's a compliment, not street harassment. And then there's, there's a few instances that, yes, uh, some guys, um, you know, wanted to talk to her. They wanted to have a nice open conversation. Again, that is not street harassment unless it gets a little bit more, well, intimidating or even more physical, if you know what I mean, then that's street harassment. But what can constitute as street harassment is incredibly fucking stupid. And considering that this is 100 men out of the many men that mi that lives in New York, and let's see, in Manhattan, there's like maybe 100,000, I think. No, not even 100,000, maybe a million. 
at the very most. And that's like less than 0.2%. 0.2% of men in Manhattan catcalled her. Or it's not even catcalling, it's just simple, you know, hello, greetings, whatever. And that's considered street harassment. You know, I know this is, it's a very slim chance that this may not be the work of a feminist. But this is very, very, very dangerously close to feminist territory. And that is saying something. You know, I might get a few hate comments, but I'm starting to believe that being gay is a choice because of women like this, women like this. They think that they're so goddamn perfect that, that we the men should just put our heads into shame. Put, just put ourselves into shame for having a penis that they're so vile so you know they're so goddamn perfect it's just incredible and plain fucking stupid I wouldn't want to date a woman like that I want a woman I want to date a woman that's has a, that doesn't have an ego who thinks that she is no more human than I am. <sighs> but if this keeps it up, then more men might end up being gay. More men might end up turning into true-blooded misogynists. But hey, that's just me. Go ahead, call me a tinfoil hat conspiracist. But if this keeps it up, then more men may end up being gay. I don't know what else to say. That the video alone is disgusting. That this person should be ashamed of herself to even consider it harassment. And you know, it would be a completely different story if these guys were stalking her around who, you know, just want a piece of that ass. That I can understand. But the fact that we can't even compliment is ridiculous. Eventually, women will put men into shame and that we would have to fear the worst. We have to keep our mouth shut constantly. Avoid the idea that we can go to jail for this shit. That's incredible. I I have nothing else to say. This woman's a cunt. And if she has children, let's, you know what? Let's pray that she doesn't have children. Okay? Let's just fill her pussy with cement and pray that no man falls in love with her. And when she does fall in love, hopefully that man does not breed with her. She does not deserve to have children. I am the Atheist Gamer. Peace the game out.